Murad 1, Ottoman Turkish, Turkish, I. Murat Hudavandaga, nicknamed Hudavandaga, from Persian, Kudavanga, meaning sovereign in this context, March or June 29, 1326, Sogat or Bursa, June 15, 1389, Battle of Kosovo Pol, was the Sultan of the Ottoman Empire from 1362 to 1389. He was the son of Orhan and the Valide Sultan Ilufur Hattan and became the ruler following his father's death in 1362. Morad fought against the powerful emirate of Karaman in Anatolia and against the Serbs, Albanians, Bulgarians and Hungarians in Europe. In particular, a Serb expedition to expel the Turks from Adrianople led by the Serbian brothers King Vukasin and Despot Ugljusa was defeated on September 26, 1371, by Morad's Murat-capable second lieutenant Lalas Shahin Paza, the first governor, Balabi, of Ramli. In 1385 Sofia fell to the Ottomans. In 1386 Prince Lazari Beldanovic defeated an Ottoman force at the Battle of Ploknik. The Ottoman army suffered heavy casualties and was unable to capture Niz on the way back. In 1389 Morad's army defeated the Serbian army and its allies under the leadership of Laza at the Battle of Kosovo. There are different accounts from different sources about when and how Morad I was assassinated. The contemporary sources mainly noted that the battle took place and that both Prince Laza and the Sultan lost their lives in the battle. The existing evidence of the additional stories and speculations as to how Morad I died were disseminated and recorded in the 15th century and later, decades after the actual event. One Western source states that during first hours of the battle, Morad I was assassinated by Serbian noblemen and knight Milos Obelik by knife. Most Ottoman chroniclers, including Dmitri Kantma, state that he was assassinated after the finish of the battle while going around the battlefield. Others state that he was assassinated in the evening after the battle at his tent by the assassin who was admitted to ask a special favor. His older son Bayezid, who was in charge of the left wing of the Ottoman forces, took charge after that. His other son, Yakub Bey, who was in charge of the other wing, was called to the Sultan's command center tent by Bayezid, but when Yakub Bey arrived he was strangled leaving Bayezid as the sole claimant to the throne. In the earliest preserved Christian record, a letter of Florentine Senate to the King Tvtko, the first of Bosnia, dated 20 October 1389, Moradai's killing was described. A warrior, allegedly Milos Obelik, had managed to get through the Ottoman army and kill Moradai. Sultan Morad's internal organs were buried in Kosovo field and remains to this day on a corner of the battlefield in a location called Meshtai Hudavandigar which has gained a religious significance by the Muslims, which had been renamed Obelik by the Serbs. It has recently been renovated. His other remains were carried to Bursa, his Anatolian capital city and were buried in a tomb at the complex built in his name. He established the empire by building up a society and government in the newly conquered city of Adrianople, Eden in Turkish, and by expanding the realm in Europe, bringing most of the Balkans under Ottoman rule and forcing the Byzantine emperor to pay him tribute. It was Morad who established the former Osmani tribe into an empire. He established the title of Sultan in 1383 and the core of the Janissaries and the Defzerm recruiting system. He also organized the government of the Divan, the system of Tamas and Tamar holders, Timariots, and the military judge, the Kars Aska. He also established the two provinces of Anadolu, Anatolia, and Rumli, Europe. He was the son of Orhan and the Valide Sultan Ilufur Hattun. Daughter of the Prince of Yahizar or Byzantine Princess Theodora Kantaxine, also named Nilufer, who was of ethnic Greek descent. In William Shakespeare's history play Henry IV, Part II, Prince Harry refers to Morad as Amurat in Act V, Scene II, when he succeeds his father, King Henry IV, in 1413. Chief Justice, good morrow, and God save your Majesty, King Henry V. This new and gorgeous garment, Majesty, sits not so easy on me as you think. Brothers, you mix your sadness with some fear. This is the English, not the Turkish court, not Amirat and Amirat succeeds, but Harry Harry. Morad, as Amirat the first, is the subject of Thomas Goff's play The Courageous Turk, published in 1632.